So you set up an IP system, but now you need to access that system and view your camera feeds from anywhere in the world. Well, you've come to the right place because in today's video, we're going to be talking all about remote viewing. Remote access is accomplished through P2P or peer-to-peer. -peer. You can think of a P2P cloud account as a middleman that sits between your IP systems network and your devices network to facilitate communication without having to mess with port forwarding or anything confusing like that. First, let's set this up with a Uniview camera. If you have a Uniview branded camera, you'll use EasyCloud. But if you have a Uniview OEM camera, which will have a different model number, and no Uniview logo, you'll use Star for Live. The apps are gonna be different, but the process is going to be exactly the same. So for this example, I'm going to be using a Uniview branded camera, so I'll be using the EasyCloud apps. Go ahead and download the mobile app and walk through the prompts to set up your cloud account using either your phone number or your email address. Once you have your account set up, you can add multiple devices to your cloud account, both NVRs and cameras. The first step is going to be to hop onto your NVR's HDMI interface or visit the web interface for your camera or recorder. Navigate to the network menu and then EasyCloud. Make sure EasyCloud is enabled. Oftentimes this comes disabled by default. Now all we need to do is scan this QR code with our EasyView mobile app. Just click Devices and then click Add Device. Now again, we are talking about remote access here so we don't want to manually input an IP address. If we do that, you will be able to view your cameras locally from your phone, but again, you won't be able to access that camera from anywhere else. So instead, we are going to click Scan. Scan the QR code, give your device a descriptive name, this can be anything you want it to be, and either click the Save icon at the top or the Start Live View at the bottom. Either way, the device will still be saved to your cloud account. Once you have a camera or a recorder set up through your mobile device, you can also access it through the EasyStation desktop application. Simply navigate to Device Management and click Cloud Device. Here you can log into your cloud account and add any or all of your cloud devices to your EasyStation device list. Again, you can now access these feeds from your computer from anywhere in the world. So that's it for Uniview. Now we're going to talk about our R-Series cameras. Our series products are designed for ease of use, so this whole process is going to be a little bit more streamlined. The apps you'll use for our series are the RX CamView mobile app and the CamViewer desktop application. Launch the RX CamView application and you'll notice that there is no cloud account for you to create here. Add a camera by clicking the plus button in the top right hand corner. Click IPC NVR DVR, then scan the QR code of your device located somewhere on the product itself or on the product box. The mobile app is similar to the EasyView app in that you can add multiple devices to manage and view both recorders and cameras. The desktop app, CamViewer, is a little bit different. It's not a full-blown video management software like EasyStation, so it can only view one device at a time. If you want to view multiple cameras or NVRs, you will need to log into the individual device each time. P2P servers make CCTV remote access much easier than it used to be. For the most part, all it takes is a little scan and you're good to go. But if you are running into issues, don't hesitate to give us a call or send us an email. Any purchase from Nelly Security comes with lifetime tech support, so we are always here to help you out. For more security tech tips, tutorials, and reviews, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us across social media. Happy installing, and I will see you in the next video.